Samsung launched its Galaxy S8 devices last week and we saw that it actually realized the bezel-less design on its latest flagship. But there were of course some questions regarding the device that were left unanswered. For example, the Galaxy S8 has a 5.7 inch screen but still packs a 3000 mAh battery. Will the phone last enough for a day? Samsung's previous flagship, the Note 7, was recalled because of exploding batteries. And the exploding batteries were a result of the curved screen that bent the electrodes inside the battery. Now the Galaxy S8 also has a curved screen. Will it by any chance face the same fate? Now phone batteries do explode and it's not a new thing. But in this decade, it's very limited and very rare. But what Samsung did with its Galaxy Note 7 smartphone will hopefully and most probably won't be repeated on future devices. Though Samsung has explained previously how two different kind of faulty batteries were used on Note 7 and how it is taking precautions so that it may not be repeated in future. But the company says it has become all the more cautious when it comes to batteries. It talks about eight point battery tests that the phone need to go through to make it to the final box. The test not only check the phone in various charge and discharge scenarios, but include X-ray scanning, testing it in extreme temperature of over 60 degrees Celsius, and even puncturing it with a nail. So these tests appear to be quite rigorous and if Samsung is actually performing them, it has gone a step further to make sure it doesn't pull off a Note 7 again. In fact, with such high testing, the phones would be beyond the normal safety standards set for smartphones. And they may be one of the safest phones you can buy in 2017.